Dr. Kostov Sahaya, MS Orthopedics. I did my post graduation from uh, Guwahati Medical College. Now currently practicing in uh, Mongolia in uh, Lipson's Nursing Home and Mongolia Civil Hospital. Uh, firstly, uh, I am going to discuss about this osteoarthritis topic. Uh, the osteoarthritis is a degenerative disorder which involves multiple joints. For example, it can involve any joints in the body like the uh, joints of the fingers, wrist joint, elbow, ankle joint, knee, hip, any joints. But the most common is the knee joint. So it is the most uh, weight bearing joint of the body. After that comes the hip and all. So uh, this commonly gets affected while we bear weight and uh, mostly it is a degenerative disorder so uh, it is frequently seen in the old age patients. Now we can see this osteoarthritis and very young people also uh, because of our lifestyles and habits also. Uh, firstly we are going to discuss about this osteoarthritis as a topic. So osteoarthritis is a degenerative disorder in which the cartilage of the joints uh, gets degenerated. So here in this case we can see the knee joint. This is the healthy knee joint with the cartilage. Here the cartilage is healthy so it is denoted by the blue color. Then gradually this is stage 1, this is stage 2. The cartilage is getting worn, worn out and then after that this is stage 3. The worn out cartilage is getting bigger and bigger and it is extending to the exterior part of the knee and there is formation of the osteophytes and also the uh, sticky or the grease, greasy substance which is present inside the knee joint this is the synovial fluid this is also getting lesser in amount with uh, the passing of the uh, or the advancing stage of the osteoarthritis this uh, synovial fluid gets lesser and lesser so the cushioning effects gets lesser and after that is the stage 4 where we get lots of osteophytes and then we get the cushion between the knee gets uh, degenerated completely and there is a friction between the damaged cartilages and the bones that's why we get the pain uh, the pain increases with advancing stage of the disease so what we can do this is the next part for the uh, osteoarthritis treatment what we can do is we can do uh, multiple exercises stretching or strengthening exercises combined with the medicines and uh, mostly we uh, get to do this VMO exercises hamstring exercises what this exercise and all that this is very important for to keep the joint moving and after that with advancing stage this is stage one two mostly we restrict our medicines to this part only after that uh, in the stage three or stage four mostly the medicines don't work as uh, stage one and two so here we have to do some kind of other uh, interventions like uh, injections or we can go for this knee replacement and osteotomies as well. So the gist of the topic that we have already discussed today is that uh, we have to take proper intervention at proper time to stop the progression of the disease as well as we have to avoid few practices that we do regularly and uh, it should be avoided uh, mostly in the old age. Uh, around 50 to 60 years we should avoid this squatting, cross-legged sitting or climbing stairs and uh, this all thing combined if we can uh, do all this thing together it will give a good life to our joints and it will keep our joints moving for a very good amount of time so do your exercises regularly, take your medicines and stay happy and uh, consult your doctors regularly and that is what uh, we have to discuss today. Uh, thank you so much. Do visit your doctors, take their opinions, take their uh, advices and uh, don't ignore your joint pains. Thank you.